Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Rise of the Ronin. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to continue the main quest decisions. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I wonder if everyone else has arrived. <sighs> well, shall we head inside? If I can find a woman with a bit of spirit, I might even enjoy myself. The British legation was burned down. They say the big wig fled with his tail between his legs. Serves them right. Those filthy foreigners made off with my woman. I can't get the image of the wounded out of my head. So much for coming here to unwind. Mm, pay attention now. You'll miss the technique if you so much as blink. Katsura? Who's he bothering now? Ah, he's drunk again. Go figure. Hey, tell this fellow how good I am. My secret techniques are quite something. Am I right? Uh, you're drunk. Go home. What do you mean? I'm as sober as a judge. Do you two happen to know this man? Could you kindly stop him bothering me? He's three sheets to the wind. Even the two of us might have a hard time with him. Hang on, you've never witnessed my techniques, have you? Well, you're in for a treat! There's a geisha, I think, is your type. Really? I can't keep on waiting! Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. See you around. Not exactly the type of guy you normally see around here. I wonder who he was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you are! We've gone and started without you! With this, we take one step forward toward realizing Master Shoin's vision. Kampai! That place would have been a breeding ground for cholera. We were right to burn it to the ground. Speaking of cholera, a firework display to honor all who have died is to be held by the Sumida River. It's a shameless attempt to carry favor with the masses. But I'm all for fireworks. Blaze bright and vanish. Hell, that's how I want to go. Listen up, men. It's time we began the next stage of the plan. The Red Demon is dead, and the British Legation in ashes. We have the momentum to finish off 
the Shogunate will take control and defend our land from the West's control. Hear, hear, and forge the world, Master Shoin, in vision. Then I have a proposition for the next step in ousting the Shogunate. Kill Kaishu Katsu. Who's that? With the Red Demon gone, he is at the heart of the Shogunate. And word is, he'll be attending the fireworks. Katsu? I've heard he's just another aspiring windbag. Is killing him even worth the trouble? It's the aspiring ones that you have to watch. Not that I need to rely on a drunkard for advice. Let's keep numbers low to avoid drawing attention. Ready to head to the river and finish him? What's the hurry? We can't afford to miss this chance. We'll have plenty more opportunities to drink. Fine. You can count me in, but let's not be reckless like we were burning down the uh, whatever it was called. I forget what it was called. Yeah, let's not burn down any more buildings. How about that? Great. We're counting on you. Sakamoto. You'll join us, won't you? I guess. If it's what Master Shoin would have wanted. I appreciate it. I'll go ahead and scope it out. Let us meet at the Azuma Bridge. Do we have any side quests? No, just the ones we can't do until we get the underwater photography. Where are we going? Oh, wow. That's actually quite a ways. We'll go over here first. Go outside this building and then go around. You had no trouble getting here, I trust. Katsu is a very prominent figure. He's likely to be in one of the boats in the middle. Once the fireworks start, you'll need to find him without anyone seeing you. You could navigate the boat's roofs, or you could swim there. I'll leave it to you and Sakamoto to do the deed. I'll stay here and keep the Shogun's men away. So. Are you all set to kill Katsu? Sure, I suppose I'm ready. The fireworks are about to begin. Hold on until then. Alright, let's take a stroll. I'm ready for action. Well, a spectacular sight. This glamour is perfect for our needs, huh? We can raise some over there. hell without being noticed. Huh? Oh, come on. <laughs> Uh. 
Damn it. I just want to loot this guy. Said he was in one that was in the middle. Okay, well, I guess we can't get over there. Very nice. Ready and willing. Damn it. <laughs> oh, that did not go as smoothly as I would have liked. Where the hell is this guy at? Thought so. Oh, really? Where did that guy come from? <sighs> Hopefully we're not like on a time limit or something. all through here I don't see anybody to kill I mean I do <laughs> I did run into people to kill I just haven't find the found the guy that we need to kill very nice Wow okay Oh, maybe over there? <laughs> Let's swim across here. We're gonna get on that boat and then go across it'll be much easier oh there's a big boat I think over there it's probably where he's at no, no. thought so Spider Ronin, Spider Ronin does everything a Spider Ronin does. Get him! Oh. 
Come on, guys. We could go that way. Very nice. guys are everywhere. I was already on this boat. I thought I killed everybody, but I guess not. Black marketeer here. Don't rush. Take your time. Thanks for your patronage. Come on, light the banner. Look, this is rather sudden. Why don't we set <laughs> with our fists? <laughs> light them up! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Damn, he's good. Hey, you're not looking so good. Yeah, no shit. I need to heal myself. I should try harder. Why won't you draw your sword? That's more logic. Hey, now, are you really trying to kill me? Damn it. the two of you have fallen in with those thugs who want war with the shogunate <sighs> fighting is such a bore someone should collect all the army's gunpowder then we could really have <sighs> a firework display the rebels went too far but they're right to want war. The Shogun, they killed Master Shoin! So you're going to overthrow the Shogun? Fine. Then what? Surely you don't think you can sink the black ship with that sword? If you've got a better idea, I'm all ears. Well, got something? I do, actually. I plan to build Japan a navy. With black ships of our own, Foreigners will think twice before sailing into our waters. Am I wrong? As for the Shogunate, you're not wrong. It's a lame duck. Seen from the inside, that's clear as day. 
But have you considered it'd be quicker to fix it than to spend all your time overthrowing it? So how about it? Do you two want to help me out? Murder, arson. Is that what Shoin wanted? I like his character. I like it a lot. Katsui seemed like a pretty cool dude. The letters arrived from Katsu himself. It seems he wants our help with something. <sighs> Ever since that night, I've been itching to take action. I want to help change our nation. But there has to be a better way. My priority is looking for the samurai with the demon claw. I'm sorry for dragging you into all this. I truly am. But I'd wager Katsu will be able to help you. I hear you there. Let's aid Katsu. I had a feeling you'd see things my way. I just can't go along with Gensui's methods anymore. Katsu's working out his own vision for what this country could be. You remember what he said on the boat, don't you? I think it's fate things ended up this way, even if I do still feel a little adrift. My gut says to see how far we can go together with Katsu. This isn't the end of the road with Genzui, though. We'll work with Katsu for now, but we're not abandoning Genzui and the others. We should make our way to Katsu's place in Akasaka. You'll be waiting for us there. Where is that at? Well, that's not that far. Do we have any side missions? We don't. Just main mission after main mission, which is fine. I don't mind that. Hey! So, you made it. Now before we go any further, let me make clear that I have no wish to fight you. Don't worry. We've decided to take you at your word. In that case, let us begin. Now. To revive the Shogunate, we must learn from the West, but also call on our nation's strengths. But we need recruits, be it in the army, medicine, or the martial arts. And that's where you come in. Before I agree to anything, can you help me find someone? Of course. I didn't expect you to render your services for free. Who are you looking for? I'm looking for a samurai with a demon's claw. I see. It'll take some time, but I'll see what I can turn up. I'm sure I can find at least a few clues while you tackle the work I set you. Quid pro quo, as they say in the West. I'm counting on you to get us the help we need. You mentioned something about medicine? That could be pretty useful 
for all the people that have cholera. While we must be prepared to stand up to the West, we cannot ignore the needs of our people. That will only aid our foes. Above all, it is cholera which demands our attention. There is an expert in Western medicine working on a cure right now in Kanda. I want to make sure that remains their sole focus. Would you go talk to them? See what you can do. I can do that. I think the military should be our top priority as well. I see you are no fool. In fact, a French military officer is currently here at our invitation, training our forces in the Western style. The esteemed Admiral Enomoto is grappling with this as we speak, but all is not going to plan. Go to the Hanzamon Gate and lend him a hand. You can leave the martial arts to us. I'm grateful, but the two of you alone will not suffice. We need large numbers of able swordsmen for an imminent operation. Ryoma, you practice Hokushin Itoryu, I believe. You know Hachiro Kiyokawa, I trust? Yes, we've trained together countless times. I've learned a lot from him. I want you to ask him to help the Shogunate. It seems he is in the Chiba Dojo. I sense this request is best coming from you. Well, I think that'll do it. I don't have any more questions for you. Very well. Please, do not let me down. Now I'm afraid I have other business to attend to. Come and see me once you have done what I asked of you. Do you mind if I leave the military stuff to you? That kind of thing's not really my forte. Thanks. Don't worry, I won't make you take care of everything. I'll do what I can to help. Oh yeah, we definitely have a ton of side missions now. Or, well, I should have done this. There we go. Hey, you there! Over here! Over here! Hey, you're Roni, right? How would you like to do some work for me? Sure, but it depends on the work. It's nothing difficult. Just a little errand, really. You see, there's a rumor that the folk around here are being spirited away by the guards. While I've never been one to believe in such mystical happenings, the fact is a number of people have gone missing. My hunch tells me something is suspicious with a nearby village. What I want you to do is go there and investigate. Why don't you do it yourself? Oh, I have. And too many times judging by the sidelong looks the villagers give me. I need someone new who want to draw their attention. Okay, but why don't you consult your superiors then? If I went to my superiors, they'd only tell me to get hard evidence. I have to find a lead first, anything at all. Fine, that seems fair. I'll do it. For a Ronin, you're pretty easy to deal with. You can rest assured I'll make it worth your trouble. Now then, the village in question lies that way. Find out whatever you can about the disappearances. 
I'm counting on you. This looks very ominous. Okay, that guy looks like he's up to no good. did you do with the fellow from the other day? Oh, you know, put them in the temple storehouse. Temple storehouse. Man, there is a ton of blood everywhere. Yeah, th this village is up to no good or some people in it at least. I kind of figured we couldn't open it up from there. Looks like we can get in right there. Oh, damn. Yeah, that doesn't look too good. Huh? You've seen too much. I can't let you leave. Yeah? Yeah? Don't die, Mr. Wayne. I don't like the guys with the uh, Wolverine claws. Though he gave us some gold gear, legendary gear, whatever you want to call it. Defeat all the villagers. Maybe that's something that we should do. Can't get up there. It's all right. Aha. Damn it. I'm 
about to end this other guy, man. The dude behind me with a spear. was way harder than he needed to be. <laughs> this guy didn't see me fighting all of his friends. How did things go in the village? The villagers killed everyone. Mm. Sure, we'll say that. I thought something was amiss, but to think that the whole village was involved. One wrong step, and I might have been spirited away myself. Well, now that the mystery is solved, we can lay the victims to rest. I'm sorry I looked down on you for being a ronin at first. Indeed, I'm glad I asked you for help. Thanks for everything. Let's go to our next mission. This is super annoying. I'm going to put available, right? I guess available. I don't know. They made this way more difficult than it needed to be. See what this person wants. Hey, you there! Lend me a hand, will you? <laughs> Sorry for stopping you like that. I promise it's for a good reason. You see, there is this local herbalist who wants to turn himself into a mummy. And he'd like someone to gather materials in his stead. What do you say? A simple job for a mighty warrior like yourself, no? Have we met before? Heavens! <laughs> I haven't introduced myself yet, have I? The name's Yoshizo Sudo. I'm just your average informed citizen. I love to write down whatever I see and hear. Perhaps you've heard of me? I've got a book series out called the Fujiokaya Diary. <laughs> In any case, 
There is all sorts of things required for mummification. Think you can get them for my herbalist friend? <laughs> what does he want to become a mummy for? It's funny, <laughs> but he said something about wanting to prove his research. <laughs> he certainly is an odd fellow, that one. Suppose I can help him out if it's for science. Oh, wonderful. I knew you'd be willing to help. It's like they say, you can always rely on the kindness of strangers. And before I forget, I've written down the materials here on this paper. In the meantime, I'll ask the herbalist for more details. Parsimons. Just grab our horse and ride over here. I need to start using that more. you see and those guys nearly robbed me of all my stock but you saved my life so please take anything you want well maybe not take but I'm sure I have something you'll want what will it be I need five fresh persimmons is there anything else Take that, and that. Is and there that. anything else? Maybe some of that. Please come again. Now we need some salt. It's the easiest way to get there. Guess go down this road here to there. Come! I kind of wish there was a mini map or something that would make things a little easier. I mean, it's not the end of the world. It's not like it makes the game bad because there's no mini map. I have played a ton of games without a mini map. Matter of fact, uh, one that I absolutely love where you don't have a mini map is Kingdom Come Deliverance. And then one where you don't even have like a compass or anything is, um, oh, Outward. That one's a lot of fun too. Huh. Yeah, you can't even see where you're at on the map. You have to pretty much kind of guesstimate where you are. And 
now we gotta find some salt. How big is this area that we're looking in? Really? We're gonna make it super difficult to find some fucking salt. <laughs> okay. Supposed to sneak in somewhere? <laughs> Doesn't look like I can talk to anybody either. Can't get in right over there. Maybe right here. assault at <sighs> poor guy great <laughs> let's go over here everything was so far away in this side oh, mission here you. Said your prayers. Scholars always needing to learn the hard way, huh? No, <laughs> <laughs> even. Hey, buddy, this ain't none of your business. <laughs> So strong. Where there is life, there is hope, huh? You really came in the nick of time. But what rotten luck, huh? How are getting jumped like that? Did you know these guys? Them? Of course not. I've never seen them before in my life. They must have mistaken me for somebody else. In any case, I knew that you were strong, but you've surpassed my expectations. 
clearly, my eyes did not deceive me. But where are my manners? <laughs> this is my herbalist friend I was telling you about. Did you bring me the persimmons and salt I asked for? Thank you. I know it's not much, but please accept this as payment. What are the persimmons for? Persimmon seeds actually help to prevent flesh from rotting. You see, I guess I will soon be proof of that. Are you really going to mummify yourself? Indeed. Which reminds me, Sudo, you may write about it in your diary. And tell your future readers to dig me up someday. Certainly, certainly. <laughs> I'll definitely include that. And let me thank you also for your hard work. As bread always falls butter side down, you can be sure we'll meet again. <laughs> That's funny. As bread always falls butter side down. He's not lying there. Let's go over here to the missions. Just go to all. I don't think we'll have enough time to do either of these. But we can mark it. So that when we come back, we can do both of these missions. And then get started on the main mission. So I think these are considered bond missions. And the other ones are like Ronin, a.k.a. side missions. So where is that at? If I zoom out, it does it. Okay, there we go. We will fast travel over here. And then after we're done fast traveling, I think what we'll do is... You know what? Maybe we, man, I, maybe we do have enough time. Let's just, let's do this last mission and then we'll, uh, hey! end the video. Ah, perfect timing. Katsu says dinner is on him. He wants to thank us for all the work we've done. And to be honest, I still have a lot of questions for him. Well, care to join us? Sure. Excellent. Let's be on our way then. Ah, you're here. So, where are we off to, Katsu? I'm looking forward to this. I'm afraid my invitation was merely a pretext to ask another favor of you. Mind if we discuss the matter over our meal? Sure, why not? You seem pretty needy, though. Thanks. You can be sure I'll pay you back for this. Everyone good with my usual haunt? Busy as we've been, I haven't eaten there in a while. At long last, the Shogunate fleet's taking shape. Even the crew's beginning to look the part. The hardest part's yet to come, though. And I'll be counting on your help in the days ahead. There's no shortage of those who say the Shogunate can't be trusted. Hence all these divine punishments. Have you heard? People are taking it upon themselves to punish those who deal with foreigners. <laughs> Damn fools. They ought to try sinking the black ships that started it all. Uh-oh. Yoma, what are, what are you doing here? Izo? Ah, huh. I didn't realize you were on duty today. Hmm? <laughs> By your confusion, I'll take it you're out of the loop. On Ryoma's recommendation, I've hired Izo as my bodyguard. Speaking of which, where the hell have you been? Well, now that you're here, you can come along for a meal with us. Well, what do you think, Izo? Katsu has real vision, doesn't he? Bet he taught you a thing or two. Ah, uh, indeed. He's a great man. You know, he didn't come from money. Had no pedigree. 
but you'd be hard pressed to find anyone with a mind as shrewd or judgment as keen. And yet he treats everyone as his equal, even the lowly people like me. I can't help but feel that if he were to take the reins, the Shogunate would regain its former glory. What? Have you lost your mind? Hey! You must Masai. help me! Katsu must die! Uh, we must fight him right now! If you're against me, I'll kill you too! The only way to save our country is to bring down the Shogunate! What am I doing? Why are you doing this, Shindo? I thought getting to know Katsu would finally open your eyes! Your message would get us nowhere! It's a waste of time! My way is the only way! You've taken Master Showing's legacy and trampled all over it. You'd better pray we don't meet again. Showing it, dogs. There he goes. Ryoma, for better or worse, Izo sees things in black and white. He's beyond my help. He's convinced that because some officials are responsible for the people's suffering, simply killing the right men in power will fix everything. So, nothing's changed since we were in Yokohama. I had a feeling Izo was going to turn on me before long. I had thought Ryoma was the only one who could reach him. Is that why you got Ryoma to work for you in the first place? That's exactly why. I hope you don't think too badly of me for it. Sorry, let's do dinner another day. And I really am going to make this up to you. izo has got Master Shoin's teachings all wrong. I thought maybe if he talked to Katsu, he'd quickly realize his mistake. You did what you could to help him. Unfortunately, we just can't get through to him. Talking to you always makes me feel better. But I just can't look the other way. It's clear we have to do something about Iso. Far too much blood will be spilled if we leave him be. Kind of figured Izo was going to turn on us, unfortunately. But, you know, all the signs were there. All right, I think this is where we're going to end the video. I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean the world to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.